Listen, dads, it's really important that you teach your kids the big stuff when they're little. Hey, Ezra. Yeah? Who's Luke Skywalker's dad? Darth Vader. And who's Luke Skywalker's sister? Princess Leia. <laughs> Very well you have done. <laughs> pew, pew, pew. Dad tip for you again, a pro tip, how to light a charcoal grill. First thing you wanna do is fill her up with lighter fluid. If you don't use a whole bottle, you're doing it wrong. Second tip, if you don't have double man height flames at the end, you've done it wrong. And finally, if you don't see puddles in the bottom of the charcoal grill before you light it, you've done it wrong. Here, let's go ahead and light her up. I've already doused it with all the charcoal lighter we gonna need. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, she's gonna go. She's going. Hey, what's up dads? Uh, I thought I'd share a pro tip with you. You know, every single dad wants to wow and amaze their kids and nothing wows and amazes kids more than a little magic. And so I wanna share with you how to do a very simple magic trick that will blow your kids' minds away. So it's a simply the disappearing card trick, right? Where'd it go? There it is, okay? So I wanna show you how to do this very simple, simple trick. So the first thing you do, is you tell your child, I'm gonna put my put this card in my hand, but when you do, you take these fingers back here and you fold it like you're a rock star, right? But you kinda of try to keep your fingers straight like that. And then you begin to wave your hand. And when you wave your hand, it makes it very difficult for the eye to perceive what's happening. But as you're waving your hand, what you wanna do is you wanna take these fingers and bring them in like this and grab the corners of the card, squeeze it in tight, and when you get it just right, you're able to open up your hand. Well, let's see if I can get this right with this Uno card. Normally I do it with playing cards, but you get the idea. And then you just wave your hand like that and the card has magically disappeared and you can bring it right back. Fun way to wow and amaze your kids through magic. All right guys, so I got some, uh, some marriage advice, all right? When you're wrong, admit you're wrong. When you're right though, still admit you're wrong, all right? And also, Keep them laughing. If you can keep them laughing, life will be great. Trust me, take it to heart. Okay, I got I got my, my dude tip for you, got my dad hack. All right, um, out here on my back deck. I, I don't know if y'all are like me, but I, I love I love birds. All right, I've got my some bird feeders sitting out here behind me in the back of my house. Um, and the problem is I got squirrels. I don't like squirrels, those little tree rats. They grab on my bird seed and they take it. So I don't I don't like that. But the problem is, is some of the people in my neighborhood, they like squirrels. And so um, I've got to get rid of the squirrels, but I don't want to get in trouble. So here's my dad tip or my dad hack. What? Ice, because you can peg a squirrel from like 20 yards with a piece of ice. And the good thing is you don't have to go back out and get it and the evidence disappears. It's, it's great. <clears throat> yes, mm, there's a dad hat for you. Hey everyone, it's Father's Day and I have two little girls that I absolutely adore. If I know one thing that little girls need, it's their daddies in their life as a strong influence. So I'm gonna share one piece of advice with you that I heard a long time ago, but I'll never forget it. You ready? Tell your daughters who they are. If you don't, the world will. Hey, happy Father's Day, everybody. I'm here to give you a Father's Day tip. You know those times when you come home from work and you're a little tired? What I'd like to do is just come into my garage and get on a bar and just hang and just let everything go. You know what I'm saying? Just let all the blood flow to your head and get real dizzy. And then that's a really good tip for you today. So happy Father's Day, everybody. Hope you're doing well, and uh, great to see you.